Lepiotus wheezing lungs. A real witcher. The word is that witcher, you know, her grace's jump posed for a painting, gearless, no less. Ah! You're taking the pickle. Another murder by the horrid beast! The Milk of the, the Peyrak Pale! Greetings. A witcher from the school of the wolf, here in Tucson. Greetings! I'm Lazar Lafar. Geralt of Rivia. Seem pretty enthused. Got a job for me? Rather. Mind you, it's no monster hunt, but I'm sure you'll be interested all the same. I'm an armorer, see, and I for years sought diagrams for witcher armor of exceptional quality, Grandmaster level. Just so happens that's why I'm here. Look what I found. This is quite the coincidence. It's exactly one of the diagrams I meant. Any idea how to find the others? Of course. I just need a partner who will help me retrieve them. For a fitting reward, of course. These diagrams somehow wound up in Toussaint? How is that even possible? Tusa was once home to Tien Sa'il, a legendary and now deceased elfin master armorer. Witches from all corners of the world came to him to forge their plate, their mail. Heard about him. Supposed to have been the best. And thus he charged the king's ransom for his work. Witches would take difficult, dangerous work to earn the coin to pay him. Some, alas, met with misfortune, and the diagrams they carried were left to rot with their earthly remains. Got it. Find them, find the diagrams. But how can I know where to look for their remains? As it happens, I learned my trade at Jensai inside. So I heard the stories of the missing witches first hand. What he told me, well, that is what discouraged me from seeking the diagrams out myself. We must strike a deal. I shall tell you all I know of the remaining diagrams. In return, once you've found them, you will let me draft a copy. This elven master, how'd he end up taking a human for an apprentice? My father forged armor. As a youngster, I helped him, then began forging my own pieces. Master Tien Sa'il saw my work and offered to take me on as his apprentice. Only now, years on, do I realize the honor that was. Alas, my master perished in a massacre later, slain by racists. Though he taught me everything he knew, 
I did not manage to complete the guild's requirements for Grand Master while he lived. I know I have no equal in the trade. Yet, uh, until I complete Witcher armor of Grand Master quality, I shall never be certain I've become my teacher's equal. Where do I look for these diagrams? I know of five likely fallen witches, each from a different school of the wolf, griffin, cat, bear, and manticore. Which should I start with? School of the Manticore. Probably know the least about it, though once, long ago, wore some armor forged there. My master said the Manticores have their fortress in the Far East. A century passed, one of their number came to him, a witcher named Merton. He made a poor impression on my master. He stank like a dwarf and still, and uh, quarreled fiercely all the time. Tien Sahil slammed the door in his face and told him to return when he sobered up. He would conduct no business with a drunk. The Witcher, however, failed to return. Folk say he got into a booze-fueled brawl with the Ducal Guard. He was arrested and sentenced. Bastoy Prison, where he was held, well, it's been a ruin for years. Still, you may want to start your search there. School of the Manticore gear is really rare. All the more reason to search for the remaining diagrams. I'd like to ask you about something else. What do you have on offer? Farewell. Good luck on the path. Sent him the book. At the annual chivalry. Uh, Lady Diffian de Tabri. Valiant knights from all corners of the world will vie for the title of tourney champion. Never Tickets still are. available, but the certain to run out quickly. Open house cool. at the Beauclair chapter of the Transnational Legends. Better to die of drink than of The Duchess summoned him. Reginald Alfrey has returned, about not to be missed, buy your you tickets don't... now, available from your me Your reputation alone. precedes you, Geralt. Send the whip away those running riot. Our dochi values peace and quiet. Ah, a professional. I like to trade with your kind. You actually appreciate quality workmanship. What have you got there?
so long. Hammer and vanity van. Do a smithy's ears. My sister saw where this one bagger buried some gold coins.
heavy plate. Some mad men's been running about the docks. No two ways about it. Lepiota's wheezing lungs. Your Real boots could witch. use some polish, they could. in the journal suggest that straight out of prison Merton went to the legendary cave. Nebiota was supposed to have hunkered down there once. That's my next destination. A smashing place we have.
Chief Merton mentioned. Need to look around. Slips of paper all over. Prayer on each one. Maybe Merton left one too. He left the prison, came here, then went on to the temple. It's not allowed that kind of beating feast is... Circle him! Circle him!
You brought peace, and somehow Ethan made our ladies more eager. A thousand thanks, White One. Let's go! Burning, stopping sensation in my ribs. Not so fast, Roach. The proud sorcerer like to be planning to witch our kids away. <laughs> the witch is it through the streets while everyone. Hello, cheers, howdy to, in need of anything. Mind if I glance at your stock? See ya. The proud sorcerer like to be planning to witch our kids away. Uh, 
stump it out your rump and fart to finish. Slower. Faster. Damn, something's seriously wrong here. Slow now. Run, Roach. about seems like should look around might find something interesting
specter in a place like this, behind a wall? Someone must have rolled some poor fellow up. Spirit can't rest in peace. Temple Merton wrote about seems like. Should look around. Might find something interesting. Spectre in a place like this? Behind a wall? Someone must have walled some poor fellow up. Spirit can't rest in peace. Spirit won't rest in peace until I bury the remains. Some sarcophagi in the first chamber. One of them could work. Soul should rest in peace now. Bread adds a spring to your step. Wine adorns your head with horns. Show me the 
sword? Hey! What's new, mon ami? Ah! Never you worry. The air here is such that one is never hungover. I dreamt I was a wolf. <laughs> One of the nights Whoa! with two Am from the tournament. She oh. said it was because of an itch he'd obtained at the bells. Quite hard to scratch under metal quizzes, you know. Just like the great beggar described it, Chapel Merton visited must be in the cave.
say might have been hallucinations. Sure as hell thought as if they were real. Not a copper to my name. Beggars here? Must, must be a test. Do not avert your eyes. Help! for the poor, sir. Help a poor soul. Last one. Wonder what'll happen now.
looks a lot like Libyota. Impossible. Not seeing visions anymore. Hope that's the end of that. some sort. Here in Buckley.
right and fair. Get it up. Something's not right. Not so fast, Roach. That's it, Roach. Not so fast, Roach. in your bloomers. Did you think I wouldn't see? We greed. We split the loot evenly, three ways. I can't help it. I've been like that since I was a tot. Maybe it's because my mum, see? Shut it. I've heard enough of that. Gentlemen, this could let us you. kill! Seems let like us we must Weak like oh. Lepiota Santos! away attacking an armed witcher. I'll never know. Something wrong with my face? Like Merton wrote about, gotta be. Nice place. Pretty as hell.
Lord, who's last stop? Run, Roach. <laughs> That's it, Roach. No two ways about it. Nice tune. Never you worry. The air here is such that one is never hung over. The guard protects. The guard serves. The guardsmen have got iron nerves. Ugh. Nothing to see here. Move along. Greetings. I hope your search goes well. Managed to find something already. Wonderful. I shall draft a copy. This is good. This at last will earn me the title of Grand Master. I thank you, Witcher. Would you craft something for me? Of course.
Farewell. Good luck on the path. Nothing to see here. Move along. Reginald Aubrey has returned, not to be missed. Buy your tickets now, available from me alone. Our little Eddie has a Reginald Aubrey has returned, not to be missed. Buy your tickets now, available from me. I'm my own master with a bottle in front of me. It's no disaster. Greetings. I hope your search goes well. What do you have on offer? Farewell. Good luck on the path. Guess as champion. Do you know the colors I would see on the Duchy's banners? Red, white, and rose. Reginald Aubrey has oh, returned. Oh, Not to be missed. Whatever. Buy your tickets now. Available from me alone. What's new, mon ami? I do not know how I will ever repay you, Witcher. Don't expect to be paid. Hope you're feeling better, that's all. Oh, yes, I feel my strength returning thanks chiefly to Barnabas Basil's care. Horrible ordeal you endured. Glad I cut it short. Yes. Years of suffering. You know what was worse than the hunger? Watching my loved ones, my children grow old and die. All my family's long gone now. The last of my kin perished decades past. I fear I've nowhere to go. This is a big house, big estate. You can stay here. Truly? I could never infringe so on your hospitality. Yet... Yeah? After all I've suffered, the years of starvation, I've but one dream. At last, to prepare food that fortifies. 
nourishes, to delight in the tastes and smells of spices, to sit at one table with others and eat. Hmm. Don't see a problem if that's your dream. You could help Barnabas Basil in the kitchen. Eating his meals, you know he's not a culinary virtuoso. Nothing would make me happier. Thank you. No, thank you. House could use a woman's touch. I've one other thing I'd like to tell you. Many years ago, my father assembled valuables for my diary. I never wet, so they remained unclaimed. These baubles are no use to me now, but to you. Well, perhaps let them be a token of my gratitude. If you wish to find them, you must go to my old home, to Trastamara. The dowry lies hidden in a barrel in the cellar. There are several barrels. You must give each a knock until you find the right one. Do just that. Thanks. I'd never expect someone with your past to feel drawn to the kitchen. Do you fear I will cook in your home as I brewed as a white? <laughs> Counting on you having slightly better taste as a human. Of that, you can be sure. I loved cooking, even as a child. My gran was a true master in the kitchen. Her spit-roasted oaks was famed throughout the land. Thought you were a lady, owned an estate. Do you mean to say a woman of my rank should have had a cook? You're right, of course. And I had the best of cooks. But I devised the dishes myself. They only prepared them. You sure you don't feel lonely out here? I cannot say yet. Too little time has passed since you freed me of my thrall. But somehow, for now at least... I do not feel drawn to the city, to others. Visited others' homes as a white? Yes, but ever at night, when all were asleep, I went in search of spoons. Remember, you can always change your mind. Decide you've lived here long enough, just say the word. I'd never wish to seem ungrateful. And I'd never want you to stay against your will. See you later. Take care, Witcher. And remember, you always have warm food awaiting your return. Renovations coming along all right, Barnabas Basil? Superbly, sir. General refurbishment has been completed. And I took the liberty of adding two racks, each upon which you might hang weapons and armor, if you've some pieces you'd like to display. Likewise, I have prepared a few spots in which new paintings might be hung. In other news, the laborers dusting out the cellar have made a most unusual discovery. I believe it's something you'll wish to see. If you say I should see it, I'll go see it right now, B.B. Wine is better than stew, for stew you have to chew. Mm, 
Strange. Something behind this wall, I think. A laboratory. Must have been an alchemist at one time. What do you get for all that work? A crook in your back, once so on in here. BB, know anything about the laboratory in the cellar? One of the previous owners taken interest in alchemy? A laboratory? Alchemy? I know nothing of it. But I understand that to a witcher this must be a very intriguing fight. It is. It was walled up. The equipment's pretty ancient, too, so it must have belonged to someone who lived at Corvo Bianco before you started working here. Whoever it was sure knew their stuff, though. Got dragonglass vials and flasks, stills, sublimators, vengerometers. Forgive me, sir, but I fear I don't follow. Just saying, it's top-notch equipment. True masterpieces of craftsmanship for use in alchemy. Brewing a concoction with this stuff versus doing it over an open fire? Well, there's no comparison. Then I am all the more delighted you discovered it, sir. Starting to really like this place. Maybe we should keep going, refurbish some more. What do you think, BB? As you wish, sir. Shall we see to the house or the grounds this time? Feels like by investing a bit of coin I could make the house more functional. Indeed, momentum is best maintained once established. Now that we've finished the general renovations, you might begin to consider such things as a new bed, or additional armor stands, or weapon racks. Also some new furnishings, and a fresh coat of paint on the walls would do much to improve the guest quarters. Thinking about buying a comfortable bed. Always wanted one. Excellent idea. In your profession, rest is supremely important. But say the word, and I shall order you a bed from the carpenters who craft comfort for the court. Great. Order me a fine bed, please. Think I deserve one at my age. True indeed, true indeed. I shall send a runner at once. The bet will be in place by this time tomorrow. Is there anything, anything else you require, sir? Let's put a pin in this for now. Remember to have some urgent business to tend to. Not the slightest problem, sir. I am here to surf whenever you desire. If my lips don't stink of wine, my if wife a single won't lady keeps it day. Yes, master. Welcome, my good sir. Need a bit of grooming.
My time's up. So long. Giddy up. Crowd around. Don't crowd around. Lower. remains unknown. Your foes have committed treason. You fight them for the good of the duchy. Captain de la Torre will give you the details. Find and rescue her busy sister. Not a hair. Geralt, good you're here. Ready to attack Duntine? See you already prepared a plan. Walk me through it. We have two objectives. To find her illustrious highness's sister and capture the man who blackmailed the vampire. Duntine is a modest complex. Several old buildings, a high wall around them. At the center of the enclosure stands an imposing keep, restored not long past by the elderly knight of the castle, Roderick. We mean to strike here, through the main gate. Then secure the area in front of the keep by storm. How many men defend Duntine, you know? Roderick maintains a team of knights for defense. They are no army, but they could number several dozen. Also, Roderick recently took in a band of foreign mercenaries. About them we know very little. Sintrian's men, gotta be. Ran into a few in town. They tried to kill me. 
Need to hit them from both sides. You draw the defenders, keep them busy. I'll sneak in the back way, find the women, make sure they come to no harm. I'll vault over the wall as soon as you start your assault. Your plan puts you at great risk. But I sense you will handle it well. Let us go. So it begins. Quick! We grab Roderick's horses and we bolt. We won't vault far if the boys out front don't hold. Not so fast. Little change of plans. Kill him! sent him to get the horses. He's looking to flee. Can't let him. I see no ducals along the road. Hmm, they must not be guarding it. Roderick was right. We can flee. We'll manage. Bloody bots, what was that? Faster! Come on, Load come those closer. crates on the wagon! Trying to escape. But be careful if you drop any. Someone's here. They've breached the back wall. Come on. Kill him. I shall show you, Rogue.
Come on. Mercy! Mercy! I... I did no wrong! Nah, kept the wrong damn company. Centrian's men, where are they? Uh, I... knew... shouldn't have let them under my roof. Where are they now? In... in the keep, ready in their escape. There's someone with them? Woman named Siana? Of... of course. She... she convinced me to let them in. And a whole pile of trouble along with them. Where is she? Pack... packing. We were to leave together, an old fool. I'd have done anything for her. Where is she? In the keep too? It... yes. Her chamber is in the tower, the top floor. Where's the hostage, the woman? What? What? What do you mean? I know nothing about a hostage. Must... must be the handiwork of my... guests. What? What will become of me? Hmm. Here. Press it against the wound. Should staunch the bleeding. I... I thank you.
Giving you one last chance. Yield. The damned harlot got us into this. Kill him! Attack! Need to get into the keep. They shall pay for everything. What? Lost your nerve? Oh. 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 I wasn't expecting to see you two here. We thought you could use our help, so... Witcher, this is no time to explain. Where is Renna? Expect to answer a lot of questions inside. Let us go then! Renna! Are you... Are you hurt? If any of them... You know me. I'd never let them hurt me. I just waited for you to come. I... I didn't know where to look. They threatened to kill you. I... Forgive me. I failed you. Now we need only find Anna Henrietta's sister. Where should we look? Do you know? Mm-hmm. Ran into Roderick, Duntine's lord. Told me where I'd find Sienna. Then speak and let's grab her. Time is short. Said she was in a room, in the tower. Very one we're in right now. 
which incidentally looks nothing like a prison cell. And just so happens there's a carafe full of wine here. Bet it's stolen Saint Real. What's your point? Giving you one chance to tell us everything yourself. I've nothing to tell. Witcher, what is this? Sorry, Dedlaf. You've been had. My friend, please. You must listen to what Geralt has to say. Rena's not her real name. This is Siana. And Siana is sister to Anna Henrietta, the Duchess of Toussaint. What? What nonsense is this? Siana was banished as a child, but it seems she trekked back here recently, moved into Duntine, and ran a Vandergild out of here. Sent a man called the Centrian to Beauclair to steal some wine for her. Wine reserved for the Ducal family. Centrian led us to her. Caught him later stealing a jewel Sian had gotten from her father as a child. <clears throat> Sorry, Dedloff. She used you. Part of her plan. If you do not, I will raise Beauclair to the ground. This I promise you. You've three days. I shall be waiting. He just fly off? He did not wish to act rashly. He's gone to soothe his nerves. Think he'll do it? Make good on his threat? I cannot say. He can be unpredictable when fury consumes him. I shall go to him. Come again? After what he just... You don't know Detlaf like I do. If I don't do as he says, he truly will destroy the city. He's more than capable of it. Conscience gets to you now? Better... Uh, better late than never, right? Well... It truly does seem the best option. Your Grace, we must proceed with caution. Guardsmen saw vampires here. They could still be about. Vampires or no vampires, my sister is here. Find her. Your Grace, that... Sianna, it's true. It's you. Sister, dear, what have you gotten yourself into? So concerned, I'm surprised. Is there an ounce of truth to it? You... You feel resentment. I understand. But I promise, promise we shall work through all the unfortunate matters of the past. We will discuss them later. Captain, escort Sianna to the palace. I shall meet with her as soon as we return. As you wish, Your Grace. And you, Witcher. You have my thanks. I cannot believe my sister was so near the whole time. Roderick of Duntine shall answer for treason and blackmail. He's no traitor, just naive. Let himself be made a fool of, paid dearly for it. Made a fool? Whom by? Your sister. She's the one convinced him to let the bandits into his home. We've discovered Siana blackmailed the vampire. Ordered him to kill those men. What? What nonsense is this? She is his missing lover. 
staged her own abduction to force him to do her bidding. He was a tool. Whole scheme was Siana's. She was behind it. You're mistaken. You must be. This cannot be true. Your Grace, I know this vampire and... What? You know him? Who is he? Detlaf. The same who so recently sat at my table and told me of Nazar. Is there anything else you've neglected to mention? A dragon living beneath Mount Gorgon, perhaps? Is anyone else here a vampire? Where is he now? Waiting for Siana. If she doesn't show up to meet him by an appointed time, he'll destroy Beauclair. He dares threaten us? Your Grace, we have three days to bring him Siana and... Not a word. You have three days to bring me his head. No more secrets. No more helping vampires. I want what I'm paying for. The head of the beast. Do you think her grace's nerves have been calmed? Doubt it. Rarely forgets, rarely retracts what she says, especially not threats. Yes, well, even I must admit Deadlove's actions were highly inappropriate. Reprehensible, even. Are you upset? Why would I be? Hmm, let's see. You're returning from your hunt empty-handed. No trophy. No new lead to boast of, then pursue. What can I say? It happens at times. Especially likely to when the monster I'm chasing can turn into fog. How do your employers customarily react when you fail to meet their expectations? <sighs> Depends. Peasants cuss me out. Merchants demand I refund their deposit, whereas nobles mostly just release their hounds. And rulers? Usually threaten me with the gallows. A most illustrious grace awaits the gentleman. Your grace, the population demands she be punished. Siona's committed terrible crimes, spilt so much blood, they... Another word, Palmerin, and I shall spill even more blood. Yours. I repeat for the last time, Siana is responsible for the death of many, true, but she is also my sister. We are bound by blood and by a shared childhood. I shall not allow her to be lynched. Your Grace, I fear the masses might rise. Storm the prison, pitchforks and torches in hand. Let them storm. They will not find her there. Siana is hidden away in a safe place. She shall await trial there until we have rid ourselves of this accursed vampire. Which, to judge by your means, has not yet come to pass. Did what we could, but... My patience is at an end, Geralt. Where is he? Where is Detlaf? Don't know. I lost his trail. Is this all you have to say? I respect your grace. All I can say is the truth. Ah. Times I hunt foxes. Do you know how it works? The ducal huntsman releases the hounds. They catch the fox's scent, chase the animal down, and lead the bachu to it. All within an hour. You, witcher, have had a week. The aid of my most excellent knights. Yet, you have tracked absolutely nothing down. I've begun to suspect my beagles might have done a better job. Then perhaps your grace should have sent a beagle instead of a witcher after the vampire. <gasps> you tread on thin ice, witcher. Very thin. 
Wisdom demands you choose your words more cautiously. But to the matter at hand. Have you managed to establish anything? Your Grace, it seems Siana tricked Detlaf, used him to murder the knights who escorted her into exile. We have reason to believe that... Your Grace! Vampires! What? Speak now! Vampires! They protect the city! Captain de la Tour defends the square near the boat landing, but so many lives lost! Damn it. If it's war this Detlef wants, it's war he shall have. Geralt, get to work. This time I'll hear no excuses. Palmer in you... Get her out of here.
Siana failed to appear as summoned. And there. Detlef was not making idle threats. Seems not. Need to make some serious plans of our own now. It's gone too far, dammit. Regis, you mentioned there was a way to draw Detlef out. A way you've avoided resorting to so far because you thought it was too dangerous. Is that how I put it? Do forgive me, and I've misled you terribly. The word dangerous is simply a scandalous understatement in this case. Regis, another inner monologue growing out of a personal dilemma. Just tell me how to flush Detlef out, force him to meet, please. In due course. But first, Geralt, I'd like you to consider the alternative. After all, you could fulfill Detlef's demand and liberate his beloved Siana. Think Detlef still believes Siana's innocent? I believe he suspects something. He must. And he seeks to understand what happened. And for that, he's declared war on the entire duchy? What can I say? Moderation was never his strong suit. Really want to free Siana? Hand her over to Detlef? Refuse to accept you consider that wise. It's hard to believe, I know. But Detlef is not actually evil, merely impulsive. He needs but meet with her, speak with her, and he will spare the city. Hmm. So say I agree to this, because I might. Still no chance Anna Henrietta will. I do not recall ever suggesting we ask her permission. Got serious reservations about this plan. Not least among them, we have no idea where Siana's being held. You heard the Duchess. She's not at the prison. Hardly a reservation. More of an excuse. I'm certain you'll find her. You must merely decide you wish to. Hmm. Could ask Damien. Duchess treats him like a lapdog, keeps him close most times. He might know something more. There, you see. I knew you'd think of something. Bravo. The meeting. What if it's nothing like you say? What if it goes sour, ends in a fight? Willing to guarantee Siana won't get hurt? It seems unlikely in the extreme that... Didn't ask for a lecture on probability. Need a simple answer. Yes or no. I vow that not a hair on her head shall come to any harm. I trust I've dispelled your doubts then. Not so fast. We're not done talking. How would I go about luring Detlef out of hiding if I wanted to? With the blood of a virgin? You see, somewhere nearby lives an unusual denizen, one of the unseen, ancient and powerful vampires, among the oldest and strongest. Mm hmm, and? Toussaint is this unseen elder's territory. All vampires owe him fealty while they are here. He need but say the word, designate a time and place, and Detlef will be forced to appear. So this unseen elder, how do we convince him to summon Detlef? We must find him first. The elder does not see arrivals unless he absolutely must. But locals, Oriana, for instance, you know, she too is a... Yeah, figured it out. All right, let's say she gets me in to see the unseen elder. What then? I don't know. You'll have to improvise, I suppose. So I'm basically stuck. Either gotta give in to a blackmailer, or fight him. You know what I would opt for? Should we free Siana and arrange for her to meet with Detlef, there's a good chance we'll all survive this ordeal. Detlef included. Regis, don't mean to put you on the spot, but I gotta know. Say I do decide to fight Detlef, who'll you stand with? Should you decide your sword is the sole solution, I shall not stand in your way. Appreciate it. Certainly hope so. Now, please tell me, what is it you intend to do? Crazy as the plan seems, I'll do it. I'll ask Damien about Siana. You won't make me beg. I knew you wouldn't. Slow down. Not promising a thing. Just want to get a feel for the situation to start with. Coming with? Of course. Many hands make light work. Damien could be in danger. Or dead. Do you think so? 
He seemed battle-hardened, more than a few scraps under his belt. Against humans, not monsters. Thought lesser vampires would heed a higher vampire's call and commands. As a rule, they don't. So how Detloff sick them on the city? I told you, he's exceptional. He manages to bend them to his will, control them with his thoughts. They'll continue attacking until he orders them to back down, or until he dies. Useless. Claws sliced through steel like through butter. We must hurry. Each moment's delay means another death. They broke formation. Ran. That scent. It's Damien's blood. He was wounded. Let's go. Street. Pointless. That's no obstacle to a vampire. They didn't know. I didn't get a chance to prepare them. <laughs> Must be in the bank, barricaded themselves inside. Recognize the battle. Anything to do, you must manage our own. So. Nice tune. You killed it! Single handedly! That harlot's brood slaughtered half my unit! I see the harlot's brood came close to slaughtering you as well. Need to withdraw. You and your men. Now. My duty lies with the city. Won't help the city by leading your men to the slaughter. Damien, conversation back at the palace, remember? I'll say it again. Your men don't stand a chance. to the wounded and prepare to march out doing the right thing now listen close silver that's what you want to use against vampires your alchemists order them to produce as much vampire oil as they can churn it out in gallons then coat your blades with it keep an eye out for alps and bruxe the shapely ones resemble women they're one moment gone the next bombs containing silver splinters are a pretty good idea Thank you, Witcher. I hope you're worth the coin the Duchess pledged you. And that you'll return with the head of the wretch that did this, skewered on a hook. Your problem's my problem now. Leave it to me. I'll solve it. How? All I can say just now is I'm gonna need Sianna. You know the Duchess's decision. Sianna awaits her trial, in custody. We know it, but we do not agree with it. You've that luxury. I do not. I've sworn my loyalty to her grace. Folk are dying. Many more will, because of one. If her grace learns I helped you, my head will roll. And ours will follow right after it. Yet still we are prepared to take the risk. 
I fear we waste our time here. Come, Geralt. Wait. When... When last I saw Sianna, her grace was escorting her to the palace playroom. Playroom? As in, for children? You sure? I've served in the Ducal Palace for years. I know it's every corner. So yes, I am damn sure. Playroom? So what, Duchess locked Sianna up in a dollhouse? Honestly, I've no clue. Look, I've told you what I saw. What you do with it is no concern of mine. Got it. I'll look into it. You get back to your barracks. Retrace my steps. Path ought to be clear. And you've our gratitude. You helped us a great deal. I helped Beauclair. At least I hope I did. Let's go, Regis. Here, the playroom's beyond this door. Fist fight with this door. Would you mind? Not at all. Thanks. At your service. Hmm. Utter silence. No one here. We should look around at least. Inside? Nope. Empty. 